Aura likes to see true centered transmitter data when applying its control algorithms and executing features such as dual rates in Aura and quick trims. So take a few minutes and check your transmitter's monitor to see if your aileron, elevator, and rudder are in the zero or centered position. If you look at the values particularly for aileron, elevator, and rudder, assuming you have your zero trim and zero sub trim already programmed, the monitor should read zero for those axes. In this case, it's reading minus one, minus two, and two, indicating that this transmitter is in need of calibration. I'm going to show you how to calibrate a DX8 transmitter. If you have a different transmitter, consult with your manufacturer. Start by entering system setup. Next, scroll down to the system settings. You're going to need to page through a couple screens here by hitting the next key. You can see below the word export is the version of firmware in the transmitter. If on a DX8 it's below about 2.4, you're probably going to need to upgrade your firmware to find the calibration screen. Now you're going to basically go through the switches. I'm going to start with the knob, sweep it back and forth and back to center. Then we're going to cycle the sticks. You're basically going to see every corner of the stick. That's aileron, elevator, rudder, and throttle. Then you come back to center. You get all OKs and then you click save. Now your transmitter is calibrated. To verify calibration, go to your monitor screen and you should be really at zero or at least one on each axis with the sub trim and the trim set to zero.